hey, do you have a new solid state drive or an SSD drive and you're trying to format it on a Mac computer, but all you can get to come up is the format of Mac OS extended and you wanna format it in APFS because you know that works better for solid state drives. Well, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to solve that error and that video is gonna start right now. Hey everybody, my name is Sean Seymour and I do videos about photography and about technology. Sometimes it's cool stuff, sometimes it's frustrating stuff. In this video, I'm gonna share something with you that was frustrating for me, and that was I wanted to format my solid state drive, which is a much faster drive than a typical hard drive. I wanted to format this using the Apple file system, which is APFS. But when I went to format it, all I got was the Apple OS extended journal and made more for spinning hard drives back in the day, right? Solid state drives should be formatted in the APFS if you're using a Mac. As a photographer and videographer, every year I go through all of my source files and my libraries and I archive everything. When I archive everything, a lot of times the hard drives that I'm using or the solid state drives that I use become available. And if I format those, I can reuse them the following year. So let me show you how I got APFS to show up as one of the format options. So to format, the first thing I do is I go over to utilities and then I click on disk utility. When I bring up disk utility, what happens is I go to my video SSD video and you can see that it's been formatted in a Mac OS extended. I wanna change that. When I go to change it, the APFS format does not show up. Well, that's not the format that I want. I don't want this Mac OS extended. I want the APFS. Typically the way that you would format or convert to APFS is you right click on the drive, go down to the very bottom where it says convert to APFS. When I try to convert it, I get an error. It says failed. I click on details and the reason that it's failed to convert it is my GUID partition table scheme is not there. It's required. So the first thing we need to do is we need to change the drive's scheme from master boot record to GUID partition map. Because it's not showing you all the partitions in your SSD video drive or in my drive, I'm not seeing all the partitions, I need to go up to view and show all devices. Wow, look at that. All of a sudden I have a bunch of other things going on here. Get ready for this to look crazy if you haven't seen this before. This is just all of the partitions that are underneath each one of your physical drives. The next thing to do is go to the root. Right click on your root drive or go up to erase and then put the scheme at GUID partition map. Once you've erased this and it's got a GUID partition map, now we can go down and we can right click on the drive itself, which is this partition and convert to APFS. You notice that when we convert to APFS, we don't get the error anymore and it actually converts that partition or that drive to APFS. You see that the scan disk extreme SSD now has an APFS physical storage drive, a container disk eight and an untitled. If I go to the root drive, Scan Disk Extreme SSD, click Erase, go to Scheme, go ahead and click on GUID Partition Map, pick the format of APFS, and let's rename this to SSD Video. After a little bit, you'll see that it goes through a process, and now we have the Scan Disk Extreme SSD has an SSD Video Partition. Now click on View, go ahead and click on Show Only Volumes, and you see here that we have a clean looking SSD video with an APFS format. When you're using a Mac and you have an SSD drive and you want the most performance out of it, that is how you format the drive to the APFS format versus the Mac OS extended, which was made for hard drives, not made for SSD drives. Okay, well, I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please hit the like and the subscription button down below. Also, I wanted to mention that in the description, I have a link if you're interested in a beginning photography class that is being put together right now. And if you're interested, please go ahead and sign up down below and I will email you when that is ready. In the meantime, my friend, format the heck out of everything you can format. Make it as fast as you possibly can and keep it simple.